Hello, Americans. Another friend of subscribers around the world. Back here, man. So this morning, I had a lot of uh, a lot of folks when I was showing, you know, a couple days ago. I'm getting the smoke. A couple days ago, you, I did the. Uh, oh, I can't even remember what it was called. Video. And I showed the my 22 pump and. I had a lot of folks, you know, asking me questions and stuff about it and um, wanting me to show it. So, today I went ahead and uh, brought out three guns, three antique guns that are still in use. And I still, you know, they work, um, you know, I use them, they're a tool, they're, you know, protection, they feed us, do whatever. This smoke's terrible. <laughs> hey! But, uh... Let's see if this thing is flaming up. But before I get started on that, I just wanted to, uh... touch, you know, I, my videos are scheduled out, uh... usually day ahead, you know, so I already have the video scheduled for tomorrow, so this will be the next day. And this morning... Early, man, I was up at, I think, quarter to four this morning, and Israel had retaliated against Iran, and then yesterday there was, uh, Muskrat had told me about it, man, a volcano going off, and <laughs> this, this world, man, the one thing that I want to say, man, is, I, man, I hope you're preparing, I hope you're pre already prepared, um, if you ain't got nothing, there's probably, well, there's no better time than the present to get out there and, uh, you know, get some preps, get some food, man, uh, whatever you gotta do, you know, man, I know there's a lot of people, man, oh, yeah, I ain't got no money to go out and do that or whatever, uh, man, do what you can do because, uh, Every every one of these videos, I always say, man, if you see this, if you see this, because sooner or later, um, and I think it's going to be sooner than later, you won't be seeing me, you won't be seeing nobody, probably won't be hearing nobody, and you probably won't even be seeing in the dark, because I really feel that they're going to, whoever it is, man, I'm not, man, I... Dude, these days, whoo, these days, uh, who really knows what, I'm going to get rid of this fire, who really knows what's going to happen, I'm going to take the fire away, there, <laughs> the smoke was getting too much, if I'm going to show these guns, I got, you got to be able to see them, <laughs> so, the one thing, uh, back to the, just everything going on, man, this is the whole world, man, holy smokes, man, you can't even, you know, I don't watch the news, I don't watch TV, you know, everything that I get from podcasts, or from reading, and, you know, YouTube, but, Man, there's so much. Man, my feed this morning, man, was holy crap, man. So, what I'm getting at, you know, and if you ain't got the money to go out and get a bunch of stuff to stock up or do whatever you can to to prepare, man, the one thing is um, it, it's an investment, man, to to buy food and whatever you might need for man, a while, you know, man, who, know, who knows, man, could be, a, could be a day, could be a week, could be three months, could be six months, could be forever, you know, we really don't know, but you definitely want to have enough, you know, to give you a breather to, after you, you know, look like, holy crap, man, the power's out, or the, you know, communications are down, or whatever oh no you know man a week you know a week would be good at least a week at least a week 
you know, better off to have months. But, and all that really is, is, uh, you know, the, the best way to look at it is it's, um, it's insurance, man. It's like, it's like having car insurance or like having homeowners insurance or whatever, man. That basically having food is a life insurance, you know, on you and your family. I get so concerned and worried for all you folks out there that, especially ones, man, there's so many of them that are, oh, man, nothing's going to happen. Government take care of me. That's the ones I'm really concerned about. So basically, man, it's a it's a life insurance policy and it's a uh, uh, savings account, man. It's a uh, it's it's a lot better to have a a big old pile of food than a big old pile of money because you can't eat the money. So that was that's all I'm saying about that on this video today, man. Is uh, God be with us all, man. We're all uh, we're all in big, big trouble. So anyway, so back now we're gonna go over to these firearms. You know, and I'm gonna show them a little bit more than I did. Now these are three three rifles that I use um, all the time. These are my go-to's. Not saying that I don't have you know more and updated ones or whatever, but these are my you know, you know the 22 I already told you it was my favorite. The other one I've got, this one here is a WH Manton double barrel. Yeah, get up closer, man. See, see, man, it's got the old hammers. Yeah. Trying to show it all, just trying to show it all. But man, it's got, I mean, this one, uh, I can't even remember. It's, um, oh, I don't remember. I found, I, you know, I looked it up and I can't remember the uh, exact date. Oh, and you crack it open like this. Old 12 gauge. Old 12 gauge double barrel. Not in great working order, but it worked. It'll do the job, man. I guarantee it. So that uh, that's one of my my prized possessions. And each one of these, what's really cool, um, of my three favorite rifles, each one of these was a gift from somebody else, you know, from different people. And so that's uh. That's pretty dang cool to have friends and family that you know think that much of you because these are these are prize these are prized possessions. And then this one here, you know, I showed. I, well, I guess I need to show it closer. A little stock, so a metal stock there. There's the there. And then this one, the one thing that I didn't say on it. is it's an octagon barrel. You know, so it's got the old octagon barrel, man. I'll tell you what, this thing is, like I said, man, it is dead on, man. You know, 50 to 100 yards, man. And it's so balanced in it. Oh, man, it is just, man, just amazing. Amazing little rifle. That would be a 22 Winchester Model 90. From 1911 with the octagon barrel that is uh, that is my baby right there that uh, always loaded and uh, not always but most of the time most of the time she's with me I need to do some uh, all these all these need to be cleaned man after the you know when you burn fires and all that, you know, of course, my guns are always sitting there close to me. They, uh, you know, a lot of dust, man. That's one thing about uh, burning and all that and having fires and all that is uh, you can hear a lot of a lot of noise. There's there's so much construction crap going. I won't even get into over this hill. I guess I will get into it. over this hill. 
the other day over this rolling hills. Actually, it was a couple hills over, but I was coming up another back road and lo and behold, dude, there is, well, to me, is a subdivision, man. There's five houses, man, with more. Dude, they are going to town, man, all these newbies in here. Okay, back to the wall, just to see that. This one here. Show it. Yeah, that's pretty nice. That one there is a 3030 lever action um, model 1894 patent in 1894 up here, over here here it's got the patent it's patent 1894 and up here it's got the model well it says model here and then it also says model here up on the the barrel and the barrel just says model 94-30 but here it says model 1894. But that one's from a 1894 30 30 lever action. I've showed this rifle before. You know, actually a few times on my on the videos. And the only thing that's a real bummer, and I still got it in there, is uh, they drilled holes in it. And there was a scope on it. You know, so they had a scope on it, you know, because man, that's it was used man it was used abused and still used but i took the scope off of it which when i took the scope off of it it didn't have the front sight i think it had the or not the front but the rear sight and so i ended up buying this marbles uh, front sight for it hey man it's it's nice 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 30-30 lever action, man, always, there ain't no, you know, ain't no better, better gun than that as far as I'm concerned. Well, maybe my 22 pump. So anyway, man, that's, uh, hope you got to see those a little bit closer and all that. And like I said, that uh, octagon barrel, because I had two or three people talking about these, and somebody was saying, uh, I think he thought it was a Ruger or something. I can't remember. But anyway. That's where we're at, dude. <laughs> that is uh, pretty much all I got for you today. You know, with everything going on, my mind's been kind of... I wasn't, uh, wasn't even all that sure about what to do for a video today with all these crazy, crazy times, man. Crazy scary times is what it is. So, man, my thoughts and prayers with all of you. No matter uh, what happens in this crazy world, man, you be careful out there wherever you are. Whether you're in the city, the country, anywhere, man. Be careful out there. Good Lord willing, them creeks don't rise. We'll be back again tomorrow. Hey. Yeah.